Tonight at 11, I did not know this. Did you know that tonight is one of the biggest drinking nights of the year? Good evening. I'm Mark Allen. I'm Michelle Kingsfield. But a new business is making sure you still make it home safely. Holly Samuels live and on your side with how it works in our top story at 11. Holly? Mark, you may not have known it, but officials know it. The Montgomery County OVI Task Force was here on uh, Far Hills Avenue looking for drunk drivers. Earlier today, they had a checkpoint set up, but they had to shut it down because of the weather. Still, driving impaired could put you in jail. And now one very young entrepreneur from the Miami Valley is giving drivers another option. While bars are at capacity for one of the biggest drinking nights of the year, 21-year-old Cody Bratton's got work to do. A lot of people don't know we exist. His company, Divine Parking, might not be a Fortune 500, but it's growing fast. I uh, actually used to drive my mom and her friends around, and you know they used to give me some money here and there. And I said, you know, this would be a great idea. Bratton started the company before he was of legal age to drink, and now he's a designated driver for hire. We're trying to, you know, in theory, save lives. So. Here's how it works. With a simple phone call, two drivers arrive at the bar. They will come into the bar and remind you it's time to go home. Just hand over your keys, and one driver will take you home in your own car. Did you miss pull up in front of the garage? The second driver follows behind in a chaser car to pick up the employee. Thank you. You. Um, you guys have a good night. Bratton's customers say it's better than a taxi, which can be inconvenient sometimes. A lot of times if there's a wait, number one, it's very difficult to get through. Sometimes you're on hold, and then it will take them quite a bit of time to get to get to you. It might be an hour away, maybe two hours. You don't know when they're going to arrive. It forces people sometimes to actually drive home drunk, and, and we don't want that. Well, the drivers would like about an hour's notice if you can give it to them. It's about $40 for that service for the drunk driving or designated driver service. And that's within a 20